Should you buy a condo or a co-op? I know everybody wants a condo, but co-ops, I swear they're not so bad. Hear me out. And the truth is, depending on your price point, you may not have much of a choice. Condos cost a lot more moolah. They are 15% more expensive than co-ops on average per square foot. That's a big difference when you're talking about a two and $3 million transaction. There's also just a lot more co-ops to choose from. 70% of New York City's housing inventory are in the co-op category. Now, if price is not an issue for you, and that sounds great, good for you, then really the decision comes down to, do I want a brand new home? And am I looking to rent this home out? If you want to rent your home out immediately or in unlimited fashion, then you've gotta go the condo route. Co-ops rarely allow unlimited subleasing. But if you're only looking for a primary home and leasing the apartment out is not in your future plans, then co-op is probably your best route. Well, you wanted to know whether you should buy a condo or a co-op, and Brett's got your back.